friend in this video lecture i'm going to discuss about how to install azure data studio on windows operating system so first here in google search box write there azure data studio then you can get this microsoft.com site click there then you can see azure data studio let's click on this download button and then after if you scroll down you can see this all this is for Windows, Mac and Linux operating system. So for here, you can see uh, Windows user installer and let's click on this 64 bit. So file is now downloading. So here the file size is 135 MB. The Azure Data Studio Windows exe file that's downloaded completed. Let's click on this open folder. Then after double click on this exe file. So this is here Azure Data Studio. Now let's click on this I accept. Click on next. 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 Here this is for desktop icon. This is here path. And uh, this tool is unnecessary. If you want then you can check it. Let's click on this install. So here this is now extracting the files. So then after let's so here this is launch if you want then you can launch or let's click on this finish button. Then after let's double click on this Azure Data Studio. So this is here Azure Data Studio. I click on to stamps. Now there after first here or uh, you can see this all so as your data studio new so you need to use here the connection let's click on new connection so you can connect here with or uh, this option SQL server is there so let's use your windows authentication or SQL server so here let's give for username and the password Database, if you don't know, let's give your SSMS. Let's write SSMS SQL Server Management Studio. So this is so SQL Server. With the help of this, we can easily get here a uh, username. Oh, sorry. With the help of this, we can easily get here the database name. Name is Adam. You can see this is the Adam database. Is there? And inside you can see this all tables are percent there. So let's give you or uh, if you click, so let's give Adam and in caption here this is let's give you optional and so server name let's give you local host and after giving this all correct information let's click on this connect. So this is here connected and this tables that present in SSMS that's come inside the Azure Data Studio. After that you can do so many operations there. You can add the extension, this places and uh, here you can see this all you can get here and uh, you can get so many options. Notebook is there. Okay. So this is how we can install. Azure Data Studio inside Windows operating system. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.